A treat for the eyes and ears at LACMA as part of Interscope Records 30th anniversary. Visual artists have created works inspired by some of your favorite songs and albums. ABC7 mobile video journalist JJ Zavala gives us a sneak peek at the new exhibition. Exhibition Artist Inspired by Music, Interscope Reimagined. And in this gallery, there are works by an incredible group of contemporary visual artists that were created in response to an incredible groundbreaking group of musical artists from the last 30 years. They began this project inviting artists to respond to their works from their back catalog. The project is something that LACMA has um, been interested in the past, thinking about you know, the relationship between art and music or art and film. And there's many artists here who are in LACMA's collection or have been exhibited at the museum and that we were interested to see their work in, in this new context as well. And we really were thinking about this relationship between what you see on the wall, the work by the visual artists and the musical artists. And we wanted to foreground the pairing so you can see um, in the graphics we were really thinking about that relationship. You couldn't have this show um, without an audio component. It is, it's a show about, you know, about music. There are two ways that visitors can access music in the gallery. Visitors will be able to scan their phones in the Snapchat app over the artwork and it will play music from the albums. Or visitors can access that through LACMA's digital guide where they can be taken to the music as well. This has, I think, already become one of the iconic images from the show of um, Andy Wiley's image of Dr. Dre. We started having the conversations about this this summer, um, which was, was quick for a museum exhibition. But there was a lot, of, a lot of hard work from a lot of people that made this happen. But we also have um, you know, artists that people might know as you know, really, I think, really prominent LA artists, but also a lot of, I think, newer artists that people are going to, perhaps a lot of people will be seeing for the first time, and we're excited about that as well. It's, it's going to be opening to the public on Sunday and then it'll be on view through February 13th um, and uh, visitors can make reservations through LACMA's website. Hmm. Good for the eyes and the ears. For reservation and ticket information, visit LACMA.org.